G'day, it's Robbie here again. Well, in that last video, you would have seen where I was building up this little steam engine from um, some photos that were sent to me. And it was pretty much complete. I was just waiting on a piece of pipe or some pipe um, to go from the cylinder to the valve unit. And uh, that arrived yesterday. And I've soldered it all up. So she's all together, and yeah, it, just a matter now of see if it runs. It uh, it still needs cleaning up, you know. This is just proof of concept. We'll get it running, and then I'll polish everything and clean up any daggy solder and true up anything that needs truing up, and yeah, coat of paint, wooden base, yeah, should scrub up pretty good. So. Will it run? Let's get on with it and see. <laughs> well, it's alive. The timing was a bit of a problem. But uh, he's running in. I'll slow it down a bit. It's going pretty good. Yeah, it still needs a bit of running in. It's, uh, I didn't think it was going to go there for a while. I just couldn't get things to go. The timing on this is absolutely critical. That's, uh, it's a little bit more pressure than the other ones I've built. Amazing what you make up out of a bit of scrap. Heath Robinson would be proud of me. <laughs> so we got by with just the one pipe. I got my truckload of pipes came yesterday, came down from Queensland. And uh, Yeah, it's running like a bloody Swiss watch. Well, like a very a clunky Swiss watch. I'll speed her up, see what she does. Yeah, you don't know how to try this sort of stuff, but uh, I don't know how it compares to Allen's or so how it runs, but um, yeah. That's the pressure reading. So it's using a bit more air pressure than the other ones I've built. Speed her up. Sounds like a petrol engine rather than a steam engine. <laughs> Pretty noisy. Yeah, it'd probably be better when it's sold on a little block of wood. It's just starting to open the exhaust port at bottom dead centre. So Right at the bottom of the stroke, as it's rotating clockwise, the exhaust port, as it gets to the rollover point, the exhaust point opens up, and then it's open for probably, yeah, almost the full stroke. So I reckon that timing is about pretty much spot on where it is there. So yeah, 
interesting little little gadget, interesting uh, valving concept, and uh, yeah, I'm pleased I did it. So it's a lot quieter when I bolt it down. I think everything was vibrating around because this is low mass metal plate. I know it's in the vice, it's uh, a lot better. Okay, that's it. Project almost complete. Just got to give it a coat of paint, put it on a wooden base. And she's done. But it's, uh, yeah, look at the next one. Anyway, thanks to Alan for sending me those diagrams, those photos. That was useful. And uh, it was a design I'd uh, never tackled before. But, uh, yeah, interesting. Very interesting. Okay, that's it from me. I'll see you next time. Cheers.